Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to find the equation of the evolute of the curve and the given curve is the ellipse. We have the parametric form x is equal to a cos theta, y is equal to b sin theta. From this, we can find dx by d theta which is a into minus sin theta and from here dy by d theta which is b into cos theta. So, we can take dy by dx which is b cos theta by minus a sin theta which can be written as minus b by a cot theta. Using this we can find the second differentiation d square y by dx square which is minus b by a is a constant, cot differentiation is minus cosecant square theta, theta differentiation with respect to x is d theta by dx. This d theta by dx, we can take reciprocal of this dx by d theta. So this becomes, we can cancel these two minus. So b by a cosecant square theta into 1 by minus a sin theta. This can be rewritten as minus b by a square. Cosecant square when we take to the denominator to sin square and already there is one sin so totally it will become sin cube theta. Now we are going to find center of curvature x bar. The formula is x minus dy by dx into 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole division d square y by dx square. This will be a cos theta. Let us write it here. This will be a cos theta minus we can take dy by dx in terms of sin and cos for better simplification. So minus b by a cos theta by sin theta. And already there is a minus. So now this will become plus b by a and we have cos theta by sin theta. Then 1 plus d by b is whole square is b square cos square theta by a square sin square theta whole division. Second differentiation is minus b by a square sin cube theta. So minus b by a square sin cube theta. Now in the numerator we are going to take LCM. So A cos theta plus B cos theta by A sin theta. We take LCM. It is A square sin square theta. Here it is A square sin square theta plus B square cos square theta. Whole division minus b by a square sin cube theta. So sin square and sin we can cancel sin cube. a square and this a square we can cancel. And we can also cancel this b and b. And we can take a minus sign before this term. So this is a cos theta minus we have cos theta into a square sin square theta plus b square cos square theta and also we have by a. If we take LCM, the LCM is a and this will become a square cos theta minus a square cos theta into sin square theta minus b square cos cube theta. Now, the first term we keep as it is, which is a square cos theta. From this, I can take, actually from the first two term, we can take a square cos theta common. So, after taking this common, a square cos theta common 1 minus sin square theta then minus b square cos cube 
theta whole division a. This is our x bar. 1 minus sin square theta is cos square theta. So this is a square cos theta. This is cos square theta minus b square cos cube theta whole divided by a. And now x bar is a square cos cube theta minus b square cos cube theta whole divided by a. So we got x bar but we have to rearrange this by taking cos cube common. So if we cross multiply we get a x bar equal to cos cube theta when it is taken common we get a square minus b square. Now I can take what is cos theta from this that is a x bar by a square minus b square is cos cube theta. From this we can take what is cos theta which is a x bar by a square minus b square whole power 1 by 3. In the same way we are going to find y bar which is y plus 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole division d square y by dx square. So this will be b sin theta plus 1 plus we have dy by dx as b by a with minus sign cos theta by sin theta. So when we square b square cos square theta by a square sin square theta whole division and its second differentiation is minus b by a square sin cube theta minus b by a cube sin cube theta a square sin cube theta. So this is a square sin cube theta. Let us check once again minus b by a square sin cube theta. Now in the numerator we are going to take LCM. So b sin theta plus the LCM is a square sin square theta a square sin square theta plus b square cos square theta and this we can take its reciprocal and multiply which is a square sin cube theta by minus b. a square a square cancel sin square theta and this cube we can cancel. Now we left with the denominator minus b and this will become minus b square sin theta after taking LCM then this sin theta we have to multiply here plus a square sin cube theta plus b square cos square theta into sin theta. We are going to take from first and third term minus b square sin theta common. Then this will become 1 and the last term is minus cos square theta. Apart from that we have the middle term a square sin cube theta whole division minus b and this becomes sin square theta 1 minus cos square theta sin square theta. When I combine with this we get sin cube theta. So this will be y bar is minus b square sin cube theta plus a square sin cube theta whole division minus b. Let us simplify this further. This is our y bar but when we cross multiply we get minus b y bar is we can take sin cube theta common. After taking common we have minus b square plus a square. Let us write it as a square minus b square and from this I can find what is sin theta that is minus b into y bar by a square minus b square is sin cube theta and minus b y bar 
by a square minus b square whole power 1 by 3 is sin theta. So we got separately what is sin theta and what is cos theta. So using this we are going to eliminate theta. So let's copy this again. Already we have sin theta. Let's rewrite it. That is first let's write cos theta which is ax bar by a square minus b square whole power 1 by 3 and sin theta is minus b y bar by a square minus b square whole power 1 by 3 and to eliminate theta the term connecting sin theta and cos theta the trigonometric identity is cos square theta plus sin square theta equal to 1. So in place of cos square theta I have to substitute in place of cos theta I have to substitute this which is a x bar by a square minus b square whole power 1 by 3 since it is square it will become 2 by 3. In the same way when I square this minus sign will go off so we have only b y bar by a square minus b square whole power 1 by 3 but when it is square it will become 2 by 3 which is equal to 1. Now we can take only the numerator a x bar whole power 2 by 3 plus b y bar whole power 2 by 3 and the common denominator I can take to the other side which is a square minus b square whole power 2 by 3. Now changing x bar and y bar as x and y we get the evolute which is a x whole power 2 by 3 plus b y whole power 2 by 3 equal to a square minus b square whole power 2 by 3 and this is the required equation of evolute.